so he seems to have made it up. This is par for the course from the president. But we shouldn't get used to this. You know, we teach our children to tell the truth. And we teach our children that the president is supposed to tell the truth. So even when the United States is celebrating a major military victory, uh, I think we should still hold the bar as high as possible for the president of the United States. Uh, you know, mm -hmm. Stephanie Grisham, the White House press secretary, took issue with the New York Times reporting and said here, is it not possible just to celebrate that a terrorist, murderer, and rapist has been killed? Yes, of course. I think yeah. it's been very clear for a week there's been a celebration uh, yeah. that al-Baghdadi is dead. But it is also possible to expect the president to tell the truth. Mm -hmm. And for now, it seems the Republican Party is okay with him spinning up these stories, even about U.S. military action. No decency, no respect, no common sense, no fucking maturity.